Hi everyone, Liz here. Thanks for stopping by. So I have an art dot package and this has come from Amazon and I've had this on my wish list for quite a while um, and yeah, it had £5 off it. So it would have been rude, wouldn't it, not to buy it. So let's get into it and have a look. And so we have one of these wonderful little storage towers containers whatever you call them so we've got lots of square little stickers there uh, well rectangle stickers aren't they they're not quite square oh we've got a, a square um funnel which is uh, quite squished but uh, that will soon come out and look at this look at this i'm hoping this is going to get me more organized <laughs> oh if i can get it out oh it's in bits okay It's upside down. Okay, this is what it actually looks like. Um, it's the one with the two drawers. You can get, I think, one with one drawer, and I think there might be a three. I'm not sure about a four. And then this part sits on the top, so you can put bits and pieces in. And I just love it. I'm stationary mad. Absolutely stationary mad. So let's just take this out of the plastic. I'm going to be using this straight away. Yay. And now all I've got to do is hope that it does fit on my Calax shelf, my IKEA Calax shelf. So that sits on the top there, look, which is lovely. And then we have these little drawers. Oh, these are like um, rubber. I thought they'd be like material. Oh, oh, that's better. I was going to say the drawers are opening, but some of these little containers have fallen over. So let's have a look. So what I'm wanting to do... Oh, gosh, these are going to be fun to sort out. Okay, maybe I'll do this off camera. Some are upside down. They've got a bit um, jiggled about, shall we say, in transit. Um, what I'm wanting to do, if I can, is put my a b's in oh, as you remember i actually sorted my a b's out into these little drawers and this little drawer doesn't that look pretty doesn't that look great and then i thought well i'm always putting stuff on top so if i've actually got oops <laughs> i'm gonna have to be careful with that bit if i've got this top part that i can put things in then I don't have to keep balancing things and they all start sliding and falling off and stuff. Um, and if I haven't got time to put my drills away, ah, she says, no, I must keep organised. I've got to start putting things away. Then I can, ooh, um, I can then just put them in there. Or I could even take this off and use this, um, you know, take it off and carry it somewhere else. Oh, just love this it's a very soft plastic this part as well these as well yeah these are all the nice soft plastic so unlike these that are the hard brittle plastic which if you drop that it's it is gonna crack or whatever or it may crack shall we say i won't say it is going to crack because they don't always but yeah whereas this it's me proof it's liz proof if you drop it it's not going to crack we've got a bit of bendability with it oh, excellent excellent and oh no they are the pots uh the, the pots oh no they are soft lids oh usually they're a bit more opaque you know they're a bit frosty looking but yeah they are definitely bendable lids so uh, they're the normal pots but the bendable lids now i think these are smaller possibly than these pots yeah oh actually oh maybe not though they're wider but not as tall so they may fit in there so let's just have a look okay we grab a tray and let me just see whether all of these in this full pot fit into there let's have a look let's have a look Ooh, ooh, oh no they don't no oh I might do oh, no not quite not quite I've got some left over okay 
so I can transfer them across because I've now got more bottles. What did we say this held? Right, okay, so this is the art dot storage container, um, two drawer with 96 slots, bead storage bottles. So it's telling me get 96 containers. Each diamond painting storage container stores approximately 10 grams of objects. So <laughs> whatever you put in. I mean, it's for beading as well. It's not just for diamond painting. So we've actually now got 96. So I will probably get all of my specials in these and then I can use these for kitting up or doing something different. Yay, I like that idea. Excellent. Okay, so it was reduced from, oh, it was more than £5 off. It was reduced from 32 99 to £25 49 pence. And because I'm Amazon Prime, I get it free next day delivery. Um, so I treated myself for Mother's Day. Um, <laughs> I bought myself a present. <laughs> okay, right, I'm going to put this back in here for now. And, uh, and oh, this is really strange. Well, this is like a magic trick. Look, they've grown while I've had them in here. Sorry, possibly why it wasn't the best. Uh, oh, <laughs> nearly spilt them colour to be showing you. Uh, yeah, they've expanded. That's uh, give them the old tap test. Get the air out in between the drills. Oops. Right, let me just see. I have two of those. Yeah, I've got a bit more room in this one, so I'm going to put a few more in this one. Isn't that strange? They all poured out and now they won't go back in. <laughs> Just take a couple more out of that one. How odd. Okay. So, yeah, because I've got these all nicely labelled up. Mind you, the labels will come off anyway. But, uh, yeah, so 96 containers. <gasps> I'll have more drills than I know what to do with. And I've just, oops, got notification today that my uh, charitable donations, oh, doesn't that make me sound good, charitable donations, um, or as hubby says, are you sending your rubbish to everybody else? <laughs> no, no. no, I sent some diamond paintings, uh, some completed ones and uncompleted ones to a couple of little charities, um, the Ugly Ducklings, and also to Hedgehog Rescue Alpha. And links down below. I'm going to add them to my charities that I support part uh, underneath. And if you do want to contact them or send anything to them, you can do. Right, I'm just going to stand these up. I think originally when these draw sets first came out, that um, the bottles didn't fit in properly they were possibly using the taller bottles and you had trouble opening the drawers but it looks like they have now solved that problem um, and art dot are a nice quality item and let's see you do get i've measured out these tubs they vary between about 1400 and 1600 drills comfortably i don't think you can get 2000 in i've never managed to do that um, did I have a spare? Yeah, I've got a spare lid there, so I have got one without a lid. Just, they're not going to get quite moved about as much um, as they have done in transit while they're in my little craft room. So let me see, there's the one without the lid. Okay. Oh, the clothes nicely as well. Yeah. Oh, excellent, excellent. I do like getting organised, what can I say? Just uh, think when everything's in its place. I think what I like most, and I, I found that with when I originally organised this craft room and made it into a prop craft room with my IKEA Kallax storage units, is the fact that once you've finished playing, crafting, making, <laughs> then everything just goes back in its place and it's wonderful. So that's why I like being organised because then I don't end up with stuff everywhere. And I've got a memory like a sieve, so I do need to be able to find stuff. But yeah, that's brilliant. So I will put those back up there. And I think, are they the same size bottles as those? No, they're the larger ones as well. Okay, 
because I know I have got two different sizes of these little storage as well. As I say, they are the more uh, rigid button plastic, but yeah, look at that. Isn't that wonderful? Oh, I just love that. Just open that and I'll have all the colours in it. And open that and I'll have all my colours in it. And then I can put, will my boat fit in the top? Mm, not quite, I suppose I'll stand it that way. And that will stand in there as well. And I can put wax or little bits of, uh, I don't know, drill pens. I could even put, you know, I've got some spare crystals. I can just add them in because I need to put those away. They need to go to be de-stored, as it were. Oh, I just love this. Love this. Oh, what's those up there? Oh, look, these are my drills that I've still not sorted out. If you saw me sorting out my drills, these are ones where the drills have actually got muddled up. So I need to go through and sit and do those. So they could go in there because that's another job, another job that I need to do. But this is just going to fit on my little shelf, lovely. And I can just say, oh, I need an A, B. I need that colour and I'll have that one. And then I might put my uh, spare crystals. Uh, I've got some squares coming uh, from... Uh, DP with sparklers uh, from Tima. Um, so they are on the way. I've had a notification to say that my prize of my $50 of sparkly gems is coming. So I will then get them all organised. So I'm not going to sort this out now. I'm not going to swap them all over now until my new little delivery arrives. But yeah, that's super. And I do like the fact that this is separate. So you can take this bit off and uh, Take it with you to your diamond painting area. You know, if you've got your pens, will it fit a diamond painting pen in? Let me have a look. It'll fit that pen in there. You can get your scissors in, get a normal pen. It's a squishy. Uh, some washi tape. Some wax. You know, you can suppose for these. Yeah, these will stand up in these as well if you've got your fatter pens. I think this is sort of more um, makeup-y, you know, for like lipsticks. It looks like lipstick sizes to me. Actually, these little bottles will stand on there as well, won't they? Oh, yes. So if you're just doing a particular colour um, that you wanted and you just wanted to take them out of this part, you could then just say, right, I'll take those three colours and this is my little diamond painting tool tray and then I've got my three ABs or sparklers or whatever i want to swap out that are sat there oh ideas 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 i love this i'm so pleased i got it so yes thank you me for buying me a present <laughs> well you've just got to treat yourself sometimes haven't you but it will get used uh, it's something that will definitely get used I mean, I suppose you could, 96, you could actually kit up in it. The only thing is it is, oh, that one's upside down. It is difficult to get to the back of these drawers. That's the only thing. But, oh, they don't come out. So that's uh, pretty good as well. It has slid out really nicely. Oh, there's another lid off there, look. Let's pop that one on as well. Just get Oh, look at that. So does the bottom drawer come out as easily then? Let's have a look. I don't think it does. It had a bit of a, a wobble, the bottom drawer. Let me just see. All right, the bottom. Just, uh, there is the bottle stuck on the bottom drawer. It's got a bit wedged. I go for the old ruler trick. Works every time. Yeah, we've got a couple at the back here. Look, there's one that's gone upside down, and one that's fallen over there. Yeah, as long as you keep them all the right way up, then you can get your drawers out easily. <laughs> oh, where this is, right? So okay, so yeah, that will slide in and out now. Yeah, so if you did 96 colours, you could have it. Mm, so you ladies that do these huge paintings with all these massive amounts of colours, yeah, you could do these. Let's just give it a quick measure. I mean, for 96 colours, that's quite a small footprint, I must admit. Just move that up by a second. Okay. Get my trusty tape measure. Okay. 
So it is uh, 10 and a quarter inches across that way, which is 26 centimetres. And that way it is seven and a quarter inches, which is eight by eight and a half centimetres. Sorry, it's 18 and a half centimetres. I was just thinking that's not very big. <laughs> and then widthways, try not to tip the drawers out. It is 17 centimetres, which is 18 and a half inches. Well, of course it will be Liz because it's the same as the top. I need to do the depth, not that way. And the depth of it is uh, blah, 16 centimetres, which is six and a half inches. So quite a nice little compact uh, storage unit. I do like the fact that it's this softer plastic. You're unlikely to break it if you drop it, but I would never say never. But, you know, it has got that little bit of give in it because it is the softer plastic. And you've got your little thing on the top as well. Oh, that's wonderful. Love it. Okay, well, I hope you've enjoyed looking at my little purchase with me. Uh, if you have, if you can give it a thumbs up, it is always much appreciated. And if you want to come back and see more and see me get this possibly filled up when I get my order of my sparkly gems, then if you press that subscribe button and the all notifications bell next to it, you'll be notified when all my new videos come up. So thanks ever so much for stopping by and I do hope to see you all again soon. Bye for now.